400,000 federal employees will be required to work without pay during the ongoing government shutdown. As we enter day five, Local 23 News taking a closer look at how this impacts the Rio Grande Va Valley. Alfredo Cuadros reports. Close across the valley, not holiday season, but due to a lack of federal funds in Brownsville, Los Fresnos, and Alamo, Texas, a common sign sharing a similar message. Due to the lapse in federal appropriations, Palo Alto Battlefield is unable to fully staff the sites under its management. Out in Laguna Atascosa National Wildlife Refuge, we met with a family coming from out of state. They visit the Rio Grande Valley, disappointed that they will have to continue their journey without much help or supervision. It's all closed up, the visitor center is. Luckily, uh, a nice federal employee came and let open the bathrooms for us and gave us a map. Uh, otherwise, it would have been a pretty big bummer. Laguna Atascosa will remain open to the public. Services that require staff or maintenance may not be available. Despite that, Laguna Atascosa is doing everything it can to help its visitors. In fact, this weekend, a hunting event scheduled for Friday will continue despite the government shutdown. Uh, our visitor center will be closed. However, we still do plan to have our refuge hunt that's coming up this weekend starting on Friday. We have a hunt that's coming up, and that is uh, expected to be still going on. For the remaining operations at the refuge, the manager and a select group of employees will remain without pay, expecting compensation when the government is no longer in shutdown. Um, roads that are hiked are still open, but the visitors should be aware that staff will be around, but there won't be as many people available to respond to an emergency. Less staff at Laguna Atascosa to respond for an emergency. However, law enforcement will remain on site to provide emergency services and to protect government property. From Los Fresnos, Alfredo Cuadros, KVEO, Local 23 News. The Palo Alto battlefield announced it will remain closed for resource protection and safety. Trails will remain open at the Santa Ana Wildlife Refuge, but limited staff may be available.